What's up, everybody? This is Tadpole Superhero playing some more Disney Infinity. We are in the interior. Hi, hi, hi Scrooge. And we're playing as Hero Hamada from Big Hero 6. Look at him, he's so cool. And I've never used him before. I've never used him before. He's just been hanging out. But I, I love the movie Big Hero 6. It's one of my favorite movies. Uh, and I love superhero movies. And Big Hero 6 is one of my favorite, and it's it's an animated movie, but it's amazing. Big Hero 6, Hero Hamada, Baymax, I love these guys. And actually, I wish that they would include the rest of the Big Hero 6 team in the in Disney Infinity, but they haven't yet. So hopefully one day. But anyway, check out check it out. It's Hero. He looks awesome, and he's happy to take a break from being a hero and saving the world to do some interior design. So let's see what Cogsworth has for us today. Does he have anything new? Have we done anything else? Uh, um, let's see, do you have anything else? We've done those. We, I mean, we can drop kick you, that's always fun. What do you have for us, fairy godmother? One of your guests loves the seven dwarves. Oh, it's Snow White. Decorate a room using the Snow White theme. All right, uh, where, where is she? Okay, let's actually, we made a snuggly duckling room. Let's, there's, there's our little arcade cabinet. It's just a little arcade, but this is what we did on the last time we did interiors. Pretty cool, it's got Tron, it's got Pinball, it's got House Mansion of the Departed. I wish you could actually play those games. I wish they were little mini games. Uh, let's let's add another room. Where are the rooms? There's so many things to go through. There we go. Okay. So this is okay. So that's only got one extra door. So we'll add a hall. Let's actually, how much space do we have in this direction? about to run out of space so we're gonna add a short hall that goes into a, a hallway it's called a three-door hallway but I like calling it an intersection we're we're a little low on space uh, yeah still like there's almost no space that direction so let's add another <laughs> Is that another, uh, yeah. This is gonna be a little bit circuitous, but that's okay. It's okay to be a bit circuitous. Okay, that should give us the space we need to put rooms on both sides. How much, how much space do we have in this direction? Plenty of space, okay. Uh, let's, let's just do a three door. Small or big? Let's do, let's do the big one. Why not? Uh, how much space do I have that direction? And I don't have a lot. I don't have any space to the other direction. Let's do a two-door room. Fine. Okay, we have to do the turn one. Okay. And let's put another. No, st stab it. St no, dang it. No. Oh. <laughs> it booted me out of the editor. Why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? Oh, I wanted to add more rooms. I'm not done yet. Okay. Uh, hmm. Can we can we do one of these? Will that fit? It will. All right. Cool. That'll work. Okay. <laughs> We're slowly expanding our uh, our our world here. So let's see how much of a messy disaster this is. Okay, then we got a turn and a turn. Okay, that wasn't too bad. So let's make this the snow right, snow right, snow white room, which means we need the one. All right, let's see what we got going on. Where is this? I don't think I've ever even actually used the snow white theme. I don't know what it looks like. Uh, Snow White. Where are you? Nemo's fish tank. Oh yeah, we got that in the last episode. We'll have to do that somewhere. Nice Landers apartment complex. Woo! Cool. Darling nursery down the rabbit hole. It's a little, uh, not as crazy as I think 
that uh, what you would call it would be Dwarf's Cottage. That's probably a Snow White theme. Let's go the opposite direction. Yeah. Oh, look at how the doors look. I like that. It's a little too similar to the Snuggly Duckling, but it's still different. <laughs> and here I was pretty happy about that. Sweet. And we get experience and stuff from it. Oh, we got the Fairy Godmother sidekick. Sweet. We're getting new sidekicks for doing, for doing missions. I should probably give it the right lamp. The right light fixture. Dopsy Turvy. <laughs> that, that's more of what I'd expect out of uh, Alice in Wonderland stuff. Dwarf's Cottage. There we go. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Anyway, let's go actually do some stuff and, and make a room. Let's just start working on another area. Let's work on the Snuggly Duckling room. Actually, we're playing as Hiro. So let's go over to the other side of the world. Other side of our mansion. Our house of wonders. As opposed to a cave of wonders. Yeah, I know, Cogsworth. You're telling me you got stuff for me. But you totally don't. Look at this. Look at this. I've, I've, I've done everything. Stop it, Cogsworth. Oh, wait. Winnie the Pooh wants something. Oh, we have to find the honey. Where is the... Oh, what? Lots of stuff on my radar. Um... Um... Where's the honey? Alright, we're on a scavenger hunt. We will create a room for Hero. But first we gotta do our scavenger hunt, because that is way more important. Yeah. Oh. Whoa, how does he fight? Oh! He uses his microbots! Oh, that's cool! Alright, his dodges are normal. But his microbot attacks... Oh, that's so cool. I remember, uh, I actually did not see Big Hero 6 in theaters. I didn't see it until, there's some honey, so we gotta collect all the honey pots. Uh, I didn't see Big Hero 6 in theaters. So I actually saw gameplay videos of Hero and Baymax before I saw the movie. And I actually thought that once I saw uh, Hero using the, uh, blah, 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 blah. what are they called? What do you call them? The microbots in the movie. Uh, I thought that he'd actually keep them and use them, you know, but instead he was just, he just spent, you know, his superhero time uh, flying around on Baymax, which is pretty cool, but hopefully in a sequel, which there really should be a sequel to Big Hero 6, let's be real here, hopefully in a sequel, hey, it's Ralph, it's wreck and Ralph, what's up buddy, I am not going to drop kick you, because you are awesome, um, hopefully in a sequel, Hero will actually be able to use his microbots, because that is such a cool piece of technology. That is so awesome. Wouldn't it be amazing if those were real, though? That would be sweet. All right. Uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Too bad he can't like do a. Too bad he can't just like glide around on his microbots. That'd be cool. I know, Pooh. We're getting the rest of your your honey. Don't worry, little buddy. Oh, there's a honey pot. How did I miss that one? And there's our baby Groot that we set up, uh, I think in the last episode? Maybe in the episode before that? I don't remember. But we set him up in a previous episode. We've got to do something about this this room, because that is... Uh, no. Just no. <laughs> and there's the last one. We did it! <laughs> we helped Winnie the Pooh, and we got more experience and sparks. Sweet! Okay. Let's... We're going to create a bedroom for Hero. Okay, so plenty of space that direction. How much space? Plenty of space in both directions. Okay, so let's do a hall. I, I, I really like co connecting stuff with hallways. Um, oh, let's actually... Let's do a short hall. I've got an idea. And let's do a stairway. What's the difference? Oh, that's just a really, really big... St okay, we'll do a normal staircase. No, stop it. Don't boot me out of that. I'm trying to do something. You silly, silly game. Okay. Okay, now, now we're here. I'll do a short haul. And then we'll do Hero's Room. Which will be a two-door something or other. Uh, 
How do we want to do it? Curve or straight away? Let's do a curve. I like the curve ones. Stop it. Stop booting me out. No. Dang it. No. <laughs> this is a little... I don't know why it auto, auto boots you out. That's a little annoying. Okay. One door room. And we need to go up here because we need to give... We need to close off his room. That'll probably be a closet. Okay. So we will spend the rest of this episode putting together heroes, heroes area. <laughs> it's not just a room. Uh, okay. So let's get the Fred's Lair theme. So, I mean, like I've said before, these, uh... The interior episodes are going to be kind of, you know, I mean, they're just really chill, more relaxed episodes than the, uh, than when we're actually running around and doing challenges and playing in play sets and doing stuff in the toy box. So I hope you guys enjoy these. Let me know if you have any suggestions that you'd like me to create a certain themed room or if you'd like me to play as a certain character uh, or what you would like to see happen in our Disney mansion. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I forgot to put up a, a light fixture. Can't forget that. But yeah, just let me know in the comments if you have suggestions for stuff you'd like to see. I mean, we have so many, so many incredible options. I'm not going to end up going through everything in in one episode. So, Or even in a lot of episodes. I mean, this is our third interior episode. And we've barely done anything because it's just there's so much to do. Oh my gosh, that is so ridiculous. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we have to we have to get this one in line to Whoa. Hello. Okay. Fred's lair. Wait, which one is it? there it is. We Oh, we should create a theater room. That would be great. That would be so great. Okay, so hallways do not have light fixtures. I think that's why we got stuck. Why, why it kind of glitched. Kind of glitched a little bit. Uh, where's the... The fish. There we go. That is so creepy. <laughs> but I love it for some reason. What are we on? Walls. And we need accents. And then we'll get the closet. There it is. Then we'll closet, then we'll start placing furniture. I love how the ceiling is like has like neon lights. That's so cool. Alright, last last area. So that's gonna be this episode is oh yeah. Gotta do that. And then Okay. So this will be this episode is just putting together a Big Hero 6 bedroom, kind of a lair. This is this whole closed off section. So let's actually start, well, let's do this hallway too. So that you've got a clear uh, distinction of where the area starts. Okay. So let's, what can we do in the, uh, these areas. Okay, do we have any... Uh, do we have any... I'm trying... I don't really know what furniture there was in the Big Hero 6 set of furniture, so... We're gonna be kind of going through this stuff. Okay, uh, no tables or cabinets, huh? Alright, sidekicks, townspeople, accent and decor. <clears throat> oh, <blah. laughs> We can put the Tesseract. <laughs> Yes, that would, that would be great. Can we put anything on the bottom floor? How come it's locking me up here? Come on. Okay, there we go. Uh, cryo to Mulan suit of armor. Cool. I've got the worst camera angles. Okay. What do we have? 
Stanley Science Fair. Where's Big Hero 6 stuff? Loki Staff. Which is funny that they call it Loki Staff because in the movies they always call it Loki Scepter. Just a little, little tidbit there. I don't know why they do that. Lots of Marvel stuff. It's really cool. But I'm not seeing... Not seeing what I want to see. That's my Big Hero 6 stuff. It's one of the things is once you've gotten so many things... Oh, cool. Megabot. Okay. Don't need that. Don't want that here. We want that in the bedroom. Uh, that's the thing is once you have so many things, so once you've bought so much stuff from the toy store, it's like, how do I find everything? How do I find what I want? There's our baby Groot. Lots of plants. All right, well, sorry about that, guys. I uh, my my gamepad died, and I, I had to plug it in, and then so I did a, I did a, I did a little jump. I did a little jump cut. But here we are. We're still hero. We're still figuring this place out. Um, what was I even doing? Oh yeah, we were decorating down here. And I was trying to find stuff. Uh, let's go. Let's just start with electronics. Let's see what Big Hero Six stuff there is in electronics. J. Jonah, you can get a TV that just has J. Jonah Jameson ranting on it? That's amazing. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, look at all this stuff. Jarvis, Command Consoles, Avengers Tower. Oh, that, okay, that goes on the ceiling. Uh, nope, uh, dang it. <laughs> I've never tried decorating in a staircase and now I know why. It's a little, uh, it's a little finicky. Okay, let's see. Any Big Hero 6 electronics? Lots and lots and lots of arcade cabinets. Which is fantastic. Okay. No electronics. Uh, seating and beds are for the bedroom. Window. What? No, what the? What in the world is happening? Okay. Uh, is, I guess there's not much of any. Wait, where's all the Big Hero 6 stuff? Wait, did I buy the Big Hero 6 stuff? I think that would be a better question. Let's head to the toy store. Cause I got all excited. I was like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna set up a place for Hero. Uh, okay. Um. Where are the themes? Where are the themes? Okay, furniture, Big Hero Six. Where is it? Where are you, Fred's lair? Ha! I didn't get any of them. Okay. Well. <laughs> that explains a lot, doesn't it? Oh, sorry about that, guys. Okay. Let's take a look through all this awesome stuff. Now let's see what new things we have. Uh... Wait. Okay, Megabot. Anything else? Hmm. Okay, yeah, 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 here we go. So we have a generic robot suit. Yeah, let's have that be... Wait, which part's the front? I can't tell from this camera angle. Okay, it looks like that's the front. Put that against the wall. Yeah, that's cool. We'll save the other two super suits for upstairs, right? Oh, that's so cool. Well, that's not really a super suit, but still cool. Okay, Fred's monster statue. That's a good one, too. Okay. Uh, I think it's about... Yeah, I think that's a good spot. Okay. Not a lot of space down in this area. There's not a lot we can do. <laughs> okay, I think that's everything, then. For accents and decor. Oh, rugs, 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 rugs. Is there a Big Hero 6 rug? Comic book cluster rug. Yeah, that's probably it. Yeah. So we can have that be. It's not really a great spot for it. 
Except I guess at the door, but you can't put it like right in front of the door. So we'll put it, ah. Uh, with the statues, it's kind of hard to situate it. Oh, we could put it. Oh, the, the camera's moving on its own. <laughs> it doesn't like what I'm doing. Uh, let's put it right there. Let's see how that looks. Let's take a look. So we come through here. We come out and whoa. Oh man, that's so cool. Fred, do not touch from Fred. <laughs> and that is, that is straight out of the movie. Although I think it was smaller in the movie. I don't know if that's in the movie. I'm going to have to look at that scene. Kaboom! Sweet. Alright, yeah, that looks alright. So, is there anything we want to put up here? Oh, maybe I can put the other two superhero suits up here. Maybe. Let's see what other stuff there is. No, not No, no, come back! No! Ah, uh, no. Okay. Oh, that's not what you want. What is happening? Okay. Uh. Uh. Okay, we do have the Fred stuff. Tables and cabinets. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything here. Accent and decor. Yeah, let's let's see if we can fit the other two superhero suits up here. Well, they're not both superhero suits, but you guys know what I'm talking about. I gotta remember Megabots under accents and decor. That's the other thing, is, is knowing where, uh, what category things are put under. Okay, mascot suit. Yeah, I'll go right at the top of the stairs. And hero suit. Can go over here. Is that the same distance from the door? Yeah, seems about right. Let's check that out. So you come up the stairs and oh my gosh, it's a monster! <laughs> and then whoa! Okay, so that's hero's ranged attack. Ranged did it attack. Oh, that's cool. I like it. And there's hero suit, which is way too big for him. <laughs> All right. One of the things I also did really love about the movie is you see all the other characters, their suits are very uh, form-fitting. Or at least like Wasabi, Gogo, -Go, and Honey Lemon have kind of form-fitting suits. And Hero's suit was kind of loose and baggy. And it was just, it was a cool little detail. I love it. All right. So now let's put together the bedroom, which we definitely need the rug. Where are the rugs? Where are the rugs? Where are the rugs? Um, hmm. Entrance rug or? Let's put it in the middle. Ah, uh, okay. Um, electronic, yeah, let's see. Is there any, are there any cool electronic things for Big Hero 6? I don't even know what the stuff was, so. You'd think they have his TV. Fred had a sweet TV. Hmm. Okay. Hang on, I want to check something. Toy store! I don't know why I said it like that, but... <laughs> okay. Fred's Lair Furniture. View pack. Okay, so we have his bed. Okay, we do have bookshelves. And we have a seat, we have a couch, we have a table. And then furniture two, we have paintings. Oh, that's where the District 51 is from, okay. So lots of wall things. A couple arcade games, not a lot of stuff, but that's okay. We'll make it work. Okay, so nothing in electronics and appliances. Seating. Well, actually, let's find his bed first. Oh my gosh, his bed's gigantic. Um, where do you want to sleep? Where do you want to sleep? Let's go over here. Um, okay. I have a couch. Ooh, I wonder. I wonder. I wonder, wonder, wonder. Oh, okay. Oh, gosh. Okay. 
Can I connect them? Can I connect them in a way that doesn't look ridiculous? Ooh, I think I did it. Well, let's find the table. Where's the table? Fred's round red table. Is that lined up? Eh. Close enough. Uh, we can add a seat. Where's the white seat? It's one of those things. Just, just it's. I find it relaxing just setting this kind of stuff up. But for some people, this may not be their thing. I mean, I, lo I love the combat system in this game. I love fighting bad guys. It's, of course, a blast. But, you know, I mean, that's that's the cool thing about this game, though, is that there's just there's so much to do. There's so much that you can make of this game. You know, you can be you can be hooked on hooked on decorating or you can be hooked on fighting or you can be hooked on creating stuff in the toy box. Uh, there's just there's tons of stuff to do. And I love that. And I'm looking for. OK, well, this work. This works. Because this is sort of a mashup of, of Fred's room and 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 what is going to be Hero's room. So, that's fine. <laughs> uh, are the bookshelves in this category? No, where would they be? Uh, windows... Maybe in cabinets. Maybe. Oh, yeah, cool. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa, wait, does this, this has two sides to it. What am I going to do with that? I guess I should put it here. I guess so. Wait, do they, do they all have two sides to them? Dang it. All right, hang on. Which side do we want? Oh, that means you can use them multiple times. Okay. So what do we want in front of the... I can put a TV in there, but let me think. Action figures or comic books? Well, okay, by the TV, when you're just gonna hang out, you probably want comic books, so. Okay, and those are different too, in terms of how the comic books are set up. Let's get this one, that looks cool. And then we can put a TV right here. Wait, what is what is what does Pinocchio want? Hey Pinocchio. What's up, buddy? Dumbo speaks the least. He never says a single word. Yep. That's a fact. Okay, I think those seats those seats are not lined up. That's okay. I can I can fix it eventually. I might want to move the rug. Uh We'll think about it. We'll think about it. Okay, let's grab Where are the electronics? I want to put a TV in here. There are plenty of TVs. I can I can find something. The Game Grid TV just just it just seems like it belongs here. Uh, let's try that. And none 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 of this is perfectly lined up. Oh well. Oh well, I say. Okay, now we can get the uh, yes the heroes painting. Where should we put that? I'm gonna put it over Fred's bed. Kinda like that, okay. Were there other wall hangings? Oh, I should have a hero portrait. Yes! Um. I don't know, let's put Baymax behind the TV. Cause that is pretty freaking cool. Uh, not sure that's quite. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing's lining up the way I want it to. <laughs> do we? Do we want the creepiest picture? <laughs> yes, of course we do. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, we can put that right there. Okay. Anything else that is... 
unique to this. Oh, they have the Dunbrock Tapestry. Oh, that's so cool. There's so much stuff that's pulled straight from the movies. I just, I love this. Okay, I think that's all the Big Hero 6 wall stuff. Let's see how it all looks. Let's see how it all looks so far. <laughs> this isn't lined up at all. All the couches work perfectly in terms of the ends to the... Oh wait, that's probably closer to that one. Okay. Time to try something different. Oh, I'm gonna have to get rid of them, aren't I? All right, fine. Fine. Be that way. Uh, what do I wanna do? Hmm. All right, I know what to do. First, let's line up the table. Close enough. <laughs> now let's line up one of the seats. Uh, I can't line these up quite perfectly with each other. Uh, okay. Uh, All right, then we need to find the couch. We can make this work. I know we can. Oh, you're being you're being very uncooperative. I don't like that. That's okay. They can have some distance from the table. I uh, um Oh wait, wait. Hang on. Pinocchio Name of Horus, Thor's hammer, Mjolnir means smash something. I don't know. I'm gonna smash you in the butt. All right. What in the world? What? Stop it! What the heck? What? What is happening? Oh, placing stuff in the interiors can be a real nightmare. Okay, let's try this again. Okay. Now. Is that line up? Is that. Uh. Can't quite tell. Let's find out. Trial and error! It works. <laughs> Good enough. Yeah, actually, there's just a tiny little. Uh. Oh well. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm just gonna live with it. If you guys are severely OCD, then I'm sorry. Look away. Look away now. <laughs> okay. Oh, sweet. Okay. Yep. All right. Now. Oh, now what? We've made it so far. Yeah! Oh, ruin the bed. There we go, ruining the bed. Look at those six heroes. We'll never see those six heroes, except as fiction. Okay, well, hmm. This is a lengthy process. We're gonna come back to this sometime in the future. But until then, uh, I think that's enough for this episode. We've been, we've been playing for a while. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been a ton of fun, and I can just get just get lost in in this. As you saw today with a slightly longer episode, uh, even though I was trying to watch the time, it did not work quite as well as I wanted. But anyway, we started work on the Big Hero 6 Lounge. That's what we're going to call this whole section. Uh, so yes, the top area functions as a bedroom, but it also has a nice lounge area. This is a cool little entry area. Let's see what Barbosa has to say. Oh, we've got a. Oh no. What flavor of soda is represented on the Ellie badge? 
Great. Oh, I got it right! I don't remember those little details from Up. It's a great movie, but I did not remember that. Okay, anyway, we got a feat. Cool. So we started our work on the Big Hero 6 Lair Lounge Hangout. The lounge. The lounge hangout. I'm not going to talk to Miss Piggy. Uh, so we got our stereo area. We've got our bedroom slash lounge. And yeah, we'll, we'll come back to this in a future episode, but in the next interior episode, we're going to be playing as a different character. Because uh, I like to rotate through characters and, and do different things. So the next episode, we will probably do away with this this ghastly pink frilly mess out here and figure out what to do with this area and these other doorways see where they're gonna lead or we might head over to the other side do some snuggly duckling whatever i don't know we'll figure something out but thank you guys so much for watching this has been hero hamada and tadpole superhero playing disney infinity 3.0 my interior have a wonderful day guys and remember to always be fantastic.